can see that the number of obese and overweight young people in, is increasing dramatically. The figures are alarming. Right now, one in three children are overweight or obese. When we see these rates increase and all the illnesses that result from obesity, whether it's cancer, heart disease, high blood pressure, this is a very serious business. Hermanas y hermanos, cuando hablamos del pollo, el pollo que comemos está cargado de hormonas. It's important for the public to know exactly what it is that they're eating and how it's affecting their health. You know, animal products are linked to heart disease and diabetes. For kids, it's, you know, early onset diabetes in addition to allergies of all kinds. When you look at kids, one in three will get diabetes, one in five has an abnormal cholesterol level. The good news is there are more people who are aware than ever before and are trying to eat in a better way. Plant-based diets, they're good for everybody and especially good for kids because it helps them to stay slim and healthy. High blood pressure comes back down to normal. Blood sugars and adult onset diabetics uh, returns to normal. Sore joints go away. These fearsome diseases I was taught never go away. They actually will if you change your food stream to a plant-based diet. And the more plant-based, the better. And uh, the ultimate plant-based diet is a vegan diet. We only get one body, so you might as well make sure you take care of it. Get involved. Serve yourself a healthy plate of food. Simple changes can have an impact on your health. Being a vegetarian to me was my edge. The way I was going to be ahead of the next guy trying to get my job, the way I was going to be ahead of the guy I had to play against. Uh, he couldn't beat me as long as he was harboring tons of flesh in his stomach at that time. You know, I've never really had to exercise before, and I think partly because of being vegetarian. I just think it's really important to eat the healthiest you can if you know what's healthiest for you. It's obviously a non-animal diet. Vegetables and fruits fight diseases like cancer and heart problems, and they have a lot of vitamins in them, too. That's what we want you all to think, that vegetables and fruits are the power to a good future. And quite frankly, healthy, good food tastes good. Nothing tastes as good as healthy feels. Change your palate, change your life, and you just have to learn to love the food that loves you. I think the next step is for the Congress to move forward to look at prevention of, uh, of disease, which inevitably leads quite quickly to food, nutrition, diet. And I just left the president's office and we just signed the Agricultural Appropriations Bill, which includes additional resources to assist us in providing more fruits and vegetables. Once you don't eat meat anymore, you can't imagine how you could ever have done it. It's a no-brainer. I mean, you, you have an environmental and social health, you know, humanitarian, I mean, you name it, there's an issue there. And so there are, there are many good reasons to live this way. I think it's really beautiful and amazing that the food that heals us, nourishes us, gives us our, our best, best selves, is also the same food that heals the planet and it's kind to other creatures. It just so happens to be a win-win for everyone. Everybody wins, really. All the earthlings win. It's a win-win-win situation. It's good for the environment, it's good for people, it's good for animals. I'm a vegan because I think we need to treat the animals right and because animal raising is affecting the climate uh, radical and because I think that uh, it's not okay to kill when you can live based on plants. The fish and the pigs are my favorite. Yeah, why don't we eat them? Because we love animals. Because they, cause they don't like to get eaten. I just find it so cool the way people treat animals. So I say, if everyone dis decides to be vegan or raw, well, there'd be no more slaughtering, no more fights, and no more pollution. And my dream world would be real. Hey, what's up? I'm Tony Gonzalez from the Atlanta Falcons, and I want to tell you, be veg, go green to save our planet. Be veg, go, go green, green to save, save the, the planet. planet.